Hey, I am Brett Lee Clark, and this is my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna take, you know those paintings you get from like Ross, or like Marshalls, you know what I mean? These type paintings, and they're like, some of them are kinda cool, some of them are cute, I look crazy in this video. Like these types, see look, that one, yeah, yeah, you get the idea. Those type paintings. So you know, sometimes, sometimes they're not that great, right? Like this one, my husband got, it's a gold turtle. Yeah, we got a gold turtle here. So, not sure why we purchased a gold turtle for $45, but we did, and it's gigantic. So um, it used to be in our old guest room. We both hate it, so don't, I'm not throwing shade. He hates it too. So I'm, I'm gonna repaint it like blue and green and like brownish, you know what I mean? Like make it look like a turtle, huh? Right? I'm gonna do that and I'm on video and y'all can watch the video. Might be a five part series for all I know, but you watch the video, I'll talk to you and we'll make this painting look better, huh? <sighs> Oh my God, okay, you get the idea? Okay, sorry. So we'll go paint now. Okay, so y'all can see what I'm doing. So this is the, it's just Mr. Man. And then over here in my chair, I got all my paint from all the years I've had paint. There's a bunch in there. And then on Amazon, I bought some more paint brushes and some cheap paint as well. Oh, they all came out. Okay, but yeah, there's my paint I'm using just so you know. All right. I got towels down. So I don't get paint on the carpet. Okay. <laughs> All right. So since it has these ridges, do you see how it's ridged? Yeah. I'm gonna do this black first, I believe, and then I'll go back and like start painting it. Eh? You say hello. You say what's your name? Hi. What's your name? Yeah. We're gonna paint this black for you, okay? Yeah. So we'll start doing that first. All right. Get me. Here we go. It's like an ASMR, guys. Look. Ooh. Aye. Oh. That's good. That's good. A little brown. You see that? Yeah. You see this? Yeah. So we're doing this area right here. I don't know why I'm whispering. Oh my god, I'm being so weird. <laughs> I'm thinking I'm gonna do a voiceover, but I'm not gonna do a voiceover. So I'm sorry. Hi everyone. Okay, I'm gonna talk normal now. Okay. <laughs> Where'd my things go? Hold on. Okay, sorry. So I'm gonna take these ridges and paint them brown. I probably already said this, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay. <clears throat> so I was gonna you I was gonna do this as like a, a get to know me and like while I paint, you guys can uh get to know me. Can you see that? It's going I'm going backwards, but look, see? Uh, I can do it badly so you can like watch, I guess. Um what was I saying? Oh yeah, I was gonna do these videos as like a get to know me so that you guys can get to know me. <laughs> and I'm not just that like the random guy you always watch like, oh, he, he does cooking sometimes and he does movie videos sometimes. He never really posts, but let's see. Give me one second. Okay, I may, I may play music for some parts of this and then some other parts I'll talk just to give you a little bit of both and you can watch. You know, I don't know if you guys want to hear me talk or if you'd rather just watch in silence and make it like a peaceful, I don't know, do they have that? Is that like a thing? Like peaceful painting? I have no idea. So what do you guys like to do? What are your hobbies? I love horror movies. I'm a big horror movie fan. I like watching TV shows. <clears throat> my favorite horror movie is probably Scream, which if you look at my channel, you would know that. And um, I don't know. Why am I nervous? I'm like nervous for some reason. What can I talk about? Hmm. Hold on, I have these um, conversation starters. Give me one second. Can y'all see that so far? Is it making sense? Uh, oh. Don't fall on my hand. Hold on. Okay, there it is. Hopefully y'all can see that. Look at my little paintbrush. See, y'all wanna see this? Dip it in a paintbrush. Give me one second. I'm gonna get the like, conversation starter cards and then we can have a conversation using those cards. Just cause I don't wanna be like, Hi, I'm Brett, I'm 37, and like, just do like the obvious. My favorite color is green, like that kind of stuff. So these are called tabletop cards. I did a video with these already, but I haven't posted it yet, so 
Anyway, you just pull them out and they have like random questions on them. It's for like when you can't hold a conversation, you gotta pull these out and just like for like a, a wine night or something, you pull them out and read them. So I'll do those and then, you know. The whole point of doing this like um, painting video was A, to be able to just talk to you guys. And then B, it's like a lot easier to edit when it's not my face. Because if I look ugly or I think I look weird, that's a lot harder to edit when it's just my voice. It's like, whatever. That's what I said. Almost like I'm doing a live, but I'm not doing a live. So let's see. So the first card says, how have your taste buds changed over the years? Yeah. Um, let's see. So my taste buds over the years. I used to like hate anything with like mayonnaise on it. Um, and I thought like pimented cheese was gross. I thought like uh, potato salad was gross, like all that kind of stuff. I used to hate. Now I love it. I love pimented cheese. I love, um, well, potato salad is hit or miss. I, I do like it if it's made correctly. If it's not made correctly, then gross. But yeah, and then like ketchup, I used to like, gag at the smell of ketchup. Oh, so there's not many things I, there's not many things that I won't eat, but like the few I won't eat are like ketchup, I hate, it still makes me gross, but like when I make my uh, meatloaf, I'm okay using it. And then like, what was I saying? <laughs> oh, so yeah, ketchup, um, bananas. I've, I've always wanted to like bananas, but for some reason I just don't like them. I'm like, it was, I, I wish I did, because that would be such an easy thing to eat all the time. I would eat them all the time if like, if I like bananas as much as I like apples and oranges, I would eat bananas all the time but I don't like them like that. Um, what else? Oh, uh, avocados. So I love guacamole, but for some reason it's like avocados by themselves. I'm not a big fan of. But I mean, if, but, but when you doll it up, I'm fine. But like eating it raw, like just like the regular, just the green, no, nothing on it, that's gross. I mean, you salt and pepper it and add some stuff to it, then it's fine, but I don't know. Weird, right? But for the most part, I like, I'll try anything usually once. Maybe I'll do that for a video. I'll like try weird stuff like, uh, what are they called? Sardines. Ooh, uh, I would try it though, just to do it. Oh, I don't know if I want to. I need to get, I need to like, I need like 5,000 subscribers before I try uh, sardines. If I have, if you're watching this video and I have, and I have 5,000, first of all, yay me. And then and secondly, uh, remind me to eat some sardines. Gross. Oh. Okay, if you want to subscribe, subscribe. If you want to like send me to some of your friends, that'd be great. I'm gonna to try to post a lot more videos um, than I have been. This is the one reason I'm doing this because it's like an easy way to post videos, just paint and talk. And you know, if you guys want to ask me questions in the comments, you can. I have like an email address. Uh, it's dearbrettley at gmail.com. If you haven't, um, if you have emailed me, I haven't checked it yet because I'm scared that no one emailed me. I'm scared that I'm gonna have like not one email in there. So I'm, I'm waiting and like saying it in a few videos before I check it. So I will check it soon if you have emailed me. Um, I'm nervous. I don't wanna be a failure. Let's see. The next question is, what celebrity did you have a crush on when you were a teenager? Do y'all wanna see the card? And this is the back of it. It's called Table Topics. This one's called Past, Present, and Future. Um, what is it again? What celebrity did I have a crush on? Okay, so I'm gay, obviously, but um, I did have crush on girls when I, I uh, but the, the weird thing is they're kind of more on like the a dominant side, a dominant side, I guess you'd say, of a girl. Like, like Christina Ricci in Now and Then. I thought she was just the cutest, like, oh my God. I had I had the album, the now and then album, now and then, now and then. So anyway, I had the album and I would sit there and look at that there and then the very, I'm gonna sound crazy. On the very front of the album, um, it was like a, like a photo booth picture, you know? Like a, like a film strip, like a photo booth picture. On the, and there was like a picture of Christina Ricci like laughing and I, I always, I always looked at him like, oh, I wanna be her boyfriend so bad. She's so cute. I loved Christina Ricci. And now and then. And then like, uh, let's see, Sarah Michelle Gellar and um, Nev Campbell and 
Who would I want that a crush on? Hmm. Rebecca Gayhart. I thought she was so pretty. Oh my god. From from uh, Urban Legend and Jawbreaker. If you guys haven't seen either one of those movies, those are good movies to watch. Urban Legend and Jawbreaker. Oh my god, I just stuck my hand in that wet paint. I should have painted the other direction. I'm so stupid. I should have started up there and came this way. I'm so dumb. Um, but yeah, uh, Rebecca Gayhart. Yeah. I'm trying to think what boys did I have a crush on? Like Justin Timberlake, I guess. Um, I think JTT Jonathan Taylor Thomas he was a cutie um, I don't know let's see in the next question let's see if it's the next one is in a movie about your life who who would play your father and mother um, my dad would definitely be Chevy Chase but like Chevy Chase like Christmas vacation Chevy Chase that would be my dad 100%. My mom, um, like, 1999 Rosie O'Donnell, you know what I'm saying, like that type of, like, the hair and all, like the, and she had like longer hair back then when she had her TV show. That, but like, gray nowadays, but like back in the day, she had like almost the same hairstyle as Rosie. So Rosie and Chevy Chase, could you imagine that movie? Oh, they probably would not get along on set. Supposedly, allegedly, Chevy Chase is not a nice person. He's very uh, rude and demanding on set, like at all times, not just on set. You can watch like uh, people give interviews about him being an asshole. Supposedly like one time on like, uh, I forgot who it was though. It was on Saturday Night Live. Uh, there was some, he was like hosting and there was some musical guest and he wanted an autograph for his kid and he made a PA, like an assistant, you know, go um, get it. And like the, they spelled his kid's name wrong. Like when, he, when they brought it back, they're like, here's the, here's the autograph, you asked for it. And um, they spelled the kid's name wrong. So he's like, this is how you spell it. And he grabbed the, the PA's arm and like wrote in like big letters, his like child's name. Like, this is how you spell it, get it right. Only, with like permanent marker. I'm like what, what an asshole. I've worked with um, so, like Tracy Morgan. He wasn't that great. Um, he was nice to me, but he wasn't nice to a lot of people. And then um, I worked with like Channing Tatum and Amanda Seyfried and Jake Gyllenhaal and Jessica Biel. I never saw any of them act out on set. Jake was very quiet and very like reserved. He like was set by himself. That was when he was dating Reese Witherspoon. I used to do, you were like, what the hell is he talking about? I used to do movies, I used to do extras casting. I'm sorry, this is my first time painting and talking and I don't know if you guys care or not, or you know, what's going on, but. Um, so yeah, what was the thing? Oh, I used to do uh, extras casting for movies. I was like the casting assistant. So like with stand-ins and look-alikes, we would cast all those. And you'd like sometimes like go to the trailer and be like, "This is your lookalike," and like, "Let's make sure y'all you're all the same height. Let's put y'all side by side." Or it just depends. I had to get Beverly D'Angelo's uh, body double because she had to at least set early, so I had to get like a a woman who looked like Beverly D'Angelo from behind. Remember, I walked into the room. I like took her, like escorted her to the set, and I like, walked in. and It was like Beverly was sitting. Beverly D'Angelo was the mom from Vacation, <laughs> but she was sitting. Um, at the kitchen table in the root in the house we were filming in, and I was like, "This is uh, Miss D'Angelo's like body double," and she didn't even turn around. Like, if someone walked into a room and said, "This is Brett's body double slash lookalike," I would turn. Like, let me see them. Like, what? Who? Let me see what they look like. But she didn't even like flinch. Maybe she didn't hear me, but it's very strange. But she was going through a lot at that time. So she was nice for the most part. Kirstie Alley was really fun on set. I think this is good. This is look good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so should I let this dry and then go on to the next something later on? <gasps> do you know what I didn't do? I didn't film it for TikTok. Oh my God. I'm trying to do TikTok and I forgot to film it. Son of a bitch. 
should I stop here and then continue the video a different, do a part two video or what? I don't know how you guys want this. But yeah, so I'll, yeah, I'll stop here and I'll do a part two and I'll like fill in the shell or something, or maybe I'll do the water and then I'll do, maybe do a couple of parts and it'll just be me talking. So if you like want to ask me questions in the um, comment section, you can. If you want to email me, it's dearbrightly at gmail.com. If you want to DM me on Instagram, that's fine too. It's Brettley Clark on Instagram. Um, or just leave comments, whatever you want to do. And then, oh, my dog's running. See, Finley, what are you doing? So, and then, um, what I'm gonna say, oh, if you want to share this video with a friend, like if your friend likes uh, vlogs or anything, or you like vlogs, this is probably more of a vlog. I'm just gonna talk about stuff, or you know, what I'm saying, like a podcast. I'll just talk about stuff, talk about the news, Britney Spears being free. Maybe I should have done that in this video. Fail. Okay, next video, I'll talk about hot topics. My bad. So subscribe for hot topics. Yeah, did I miss anything on this side? I can't see. Um, but yeah, so yeah, subscribe and like and send it to a friend. And thank you so much. Follow me on Instagram. I don't know what else to say, but tune in for the next pain video coming soon. I'm gonna make it blue and green and other colors. Okay, all right, bye. Ow.